Hey everyone, welcome to Wild Breakaway with Tom Chorsky. I'm Audra Martin. Once again, the Minnesota Wild follow up a tough loss with a great team win tonight, defeating the Vancouver Canucks 6 to 3 in front of their home crowd. It was a great team effort, but it was led by Mikhail Granlin with a huge career night, first career hat trick, and extends his NHL leading point streak to 12 straight games. It was a great night in Vancouver. Yeah, this guy's really breaking out, uh, putting a nice season together. Game's got to be slowing down for him. The way he's uh, finding those soft areas and, and some of his goals are, are coming from being smart and crafty and some are coming from being very hardworking and gritty. And, and that's what's great to see for him. He's only 24 years old, so there's a lot of, lot of career left for this guy on the upside. Well, here's a look at tonight's final stats from Vancouver. 39 shots on goal for the Minnesota Wild, 27 for the Canucks. Great to see that number under 30. That was a point of emphasis for tonight's game from the head coach. Wild couldn't get it done on their one power play opportunity, and they do give up yet another power play goal to the Canucks uh, tonight. Faceoffs go in favor of the Vancouver Canucks, but again, it was all about Mikhail Granlin setting a career highs now in goals and points. Here's what his head coach had to say. Pretty special player. I mean, I've only seen him for 51 games now, but in my mind, he's a pretty special player. Um, I don't know <clears throat> where he was in the past, or, uh, you know, I know he was a good player in the past, but his numbers weren't quite what they are now. But, uh, boy, he can make plays, he skates, he defends. Uh, um, you know, I can't say enough about him. So here's a look at what's next for the Wild. The road trip comes to an end Tuesday night as they take on the Winnipeg Jets. Then they return home to face the always dangerous Chicago Blackhawks Wednesday night. And then Friday, it's the Tampa Bay Lightning who are in town to take on the Wild. But, of course, this road trip comes to an end against the Winnipeg Jets who have plenty of weapons. And once again, as we've seen so much on this road trip already, it's another team who's fighting to stay alive in the playoff picture. Yes, plenty of weapons. You're right. Uh, you know, guys like Blake Wheeler and Shifley and Lion A and Bufflin. These guys can they can bring it uh, uh, any night of the week. So they have to be careful uh, not to take them too lightly. Winnipeg stumbled tonight uh, against the Colorado Avalanche, but before that, they beat St. Louis, they beat Dallas, and they beat Chicago. So they're they're a good team, and as you mentioned, they're fighting for a spot. Well, the Minnesota Wild are the best road team in the NHL. We saw again tonight just why that is. Hopefully that continues Tuesday night. We look forward to seeing you at 630 for Wild Live. But in the meantime, for Tom Chorsky, I'm Audra Martin. Thanks for joining us on tonight's Wild Breakaway.